For three weeks, there's been sightings, a few fuzzy photos, so far nothing. The gainery in Crockery Lake is going by the way of Bigfoot and Loch Ness. Not so fast as a Florida alligator hunter whose capturing of the reptile will also be a homecoming. This was the first sighting in this little cove. Many believe it's real. And they saw it close up to the shore. But as the saying goes, picks or it didn't happen. And they went to get their, get their phone to take a picture and then it slithered back in the water. No great picks, no proof, not going to stop part-time alligator hunter Dan Rooks from trying to find and capture the gator. It's definitely compelling enough to, to go up there and put in the time and effort to look for the thing. Maybe it's meant to be. What are the odds that a random lake uh, in, in Ottawa County, Michigan, has, has an alligator uh, that has gained some notoriety. Rooks knows the area well. It's a lake that I grew up on. His parents live on Crockery Lake. I just happen to trap alligators in Florida. First step in finding it, a night search. Look for the gator's red eyes. When you see the eyes glow, I mean, they really stick out. You know, they, you're, you're going to really be able to see that even even from a half a mile off with a bright light. Once found, Rooks will use heavy fishing rods with meat as bait to reel it in. Cast on it and uh, get it grabbed and, and reel it in and um, put a noose around it, pull it into the boat, secure it, and then uh, just as easy as that. Rooks says the situation is sad. The only way an alligator could be lurking in here is because someone released it into the lake. You know, it's not going to survive a winter, obviously, in Michigan, so it'd be really nice to be able to you know, of course, live capture it. Rooks is 50-50 if the late gator exists, but wants to use his knowledge to end the speculation. You know, it's, it's not that big of a lake. Who else can combine experience with some solid home lake advantage? You know, there's place, places to hide, but not that many. You know, I'm good at what I do. Rooks is confident if there is a gator here, he will catch it. After that, it will be turned over to an alligator preserve here in Michigan. At Crocker Lake, Darren Bauer, Fox 17 News.